But first tonight, the small community of Oconee County is on alert after a school custodian without prior convictions is canned. Good evening and welcome. I'm Tom Haynes. The sheriff's office has charged him with unlawful surveillance. They say a student found Timothy Brian Burnett's phone recording video in the high school girls locker room. Fox News' Laura Neal is in Oconee County with more for us tonight. Today, a 15 year old student here at Oconee County High School says she and all of her classmates were shocked to learn about what happened in the girls locker room. Well, so it's shocking that something like this would happen at this school. Jasmine Baker tells us she goes to Oconee County High School. Baker says she and her friends are relieved to hear custodian Timothy Brian Burnett was charged and fired so quickly. I feel good that they handled it very quickly and um, that they got the authorities involved and I want to thank the girls who were very keen in um, spotting the camera. Oconee County Sheriff's deputies tell us they have a great relationship with the school. They got a call from the principal Wednesday afternoon and jumped into action. Um, so they were there within just a matter of minutes. Um, quickly interviewed uh, the suspect and placed him under arrest. The district sent this email to parents Thursday. In it, they explain what happened and make a point to say, we are appreciative of the continued service provided by the Oconee County Sheriff's Office. Chief Deputy Weems says they aren't the only agency involved. Uh, also this morning, I made contact with the FBI. Should there be any instances of videos of this nature being transmitted, those would be federal charges. Other parents we spoke to in town say they're shocked to learn something like this happened in their community. They also make a point to say they have a lot of faith in their law enforcement. Yeah, we, we do all. I mean, I sometimes leave my doors unlocked and, you know, we do feel, a, you know, a, an increased sense of safety around here for sure. Sheriff's deputies say Burnett is just sitting on one charge at the moment, but depending on what they find on his phone and what other agencies find from what they got from his home, he could be facing a lot more. In Oconee County, Laura Neal, Fox 5 News.